Hello there, TikTok has well and truly taken the beauty world by storm and is now the most obvious reason that old favourite you forgot to buy a backup of cannot be found anywhere. Products go viral and fly off the shelves quicker than you can say black honey. I'm not on TikTok but I hear what's trending over there everywhere so if you're not on the platform either but you're intrigued like I am, I've put together my personal best of TikTok beauty. Viral products I can vouch for and have been a fan of for years in some cases. Regular viewers will recognise them all. This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Very grateful to be back working with them again this year. They're the all-in-one website builder I use to make matildaonvideo.com. You can find an abridged version of my viral beauty pics in a blog post there. This is like a mini routine with 10 favourite formulas that have become social media sensations. While researching these viral products, I spotted plenty of other personal favourites if you want me to continue this TikTok beauty cheat sheet in future. Today's categories, brows, bronze and glow, blush, eyes and lips. Lots of creamy formulas here, I love them and apparently TikTok does too. Bold brows are in on TikTok, I believe. I feel like I'm about 95 years old being like, what are the kids wearing these days? But I'm into bold brows too, so I'm glad to see one of my 2021 favourites making a splash over there. Refi's Brow Sculpt Shape and Hold Gel is the most powerful brow tamer I've tried. I reviewed more of Refi's range, but Brow Sculpt is the only step I'd repurchase. A sticky gel slash glue that dries clear and gives you laminated looking brows after the spoolie alone, plus the comb and brush hidden in the cap which is completely falling apart. Very well loved. In the bronze and glow department, not surprising to see Charlotte Tilbury really taking off on TikTok. Charlotte's Hollywood contour wand and her beauty light wand were the subject of the sixth beauty video I ever filmed back in 2017 when they launched. This light liquid formula and sponge tip applicator is a fantastic contour if you're not really that into contouring or you want to sculpt the day away. Just use the little on off twist and squeeze to push up more product through the sponge. Very easy to blend with your fingers or a brush for a soft focus shadow in the hollows of your cheeks that's good enough for Hollywood stars. See my Zendaya makeup bag video. If you're into fresh faced minimal makeup you're in the right place here and apparently that glowy lots of steps to look effortless style is taking off on TikTok as the clean beauty look. Undone Beauty's water bronzer pops up in that category and I'm so happy more people are finding out about this because it's one of my most underrated cream products. It was in my 2019 favourites and 2021 favourites, stood the test of time, nowhere near as scary as it looks in the tube. I'm really layering this but it's still incredibly sheer and subtle so it's pretty mistake proof and very user friendly. Could Charlotte Tilbury's Beauty Light Wand in Pink Gasm be the biggest beauty social media success story recently? After Madison Beer's Vogue video and a tornado of TikTok appearances, it's been consistently sold out and disappears as soon as it restocks. Big Beauty Light Wand fan, the original Spotlight is my favourite for a glamorous champagne glow, but Pink Gasm from my previous spring makeup edit is a metallic pink with gold glitter, like a blush highlight hybrid for glowy cheeks. Really like the thin texture of these tubes so you can blend it out or build it up seamlessly. Couldn't be happier that TikTok has been highlighting the joys of cream blush, my favourite corner of the makeup world. Hello to another 2021 favourite, TikTok creators Rudy Berry and Michaela Nagera put a lot of eyeballs on the M Cosmetics So Soft blushes when they raved about them. One of my favourite launches last year, an instant addition to my best blush stick list. You can find my swatching video of the range below. It's rare for something this pigmented to blend so flawlessly. The moussey texture blurs beautifully with wear time more like a cream to powder and the skin like satin finish gives your cheeks a little bit of a luminous look. Venetian Rose, the brand's antique deep rose, has been in my everyday makeup bag for months. Another blush bottle you'll spot on TikTok cheeks is the Rare Beauty Soft Pinch Liquid Blush. It comes in a matte version, swatched in my original Rare review, but the dewy finish, bold peach shade Joy just brightens your day. Not just because it is pigmented, so intense, so scrape off all of the excess and one to two doe foot dots on each cheek is plenty. You can catch more dewy blush options in my Cream Blush Chronicles episode, or the latest trend is to dab a bit of Rare's Liquid Luminizer in between your blush dots and blend together for radiant cheeks. A bit like the effect of Charlotte Tilbury Pink Gasm. 
bringing back a very old favourite in the eyeshadow category, the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil shade Milk has been making waves as a great multitasker. It's a light matte milky colour so it's a great inner corner highlight. I don't have Milk but Cottage Cheese is very similar, just a slightly more icy shimmery version which I like in a highlight. The crayon is easy to swipe on to brighten up the eyes or skin and soft enough to smudge with your fingers. These sticks are such a star in the drugstore makeup world. I found them through Violette FR's videos years ago and Rust and Bronze were in my very first makeup favourites in 2017. Let's finish with the trio of sheer lipsticks and glosses on everybody's lips. Clinique's Almost Lipstick in Black Honey has experienced the most remarkable revival thanks to TikTok. A product invented in 1971 is suddenly impossible to find 50 years later because people on TikTok discovered Liv Tyler wore it in Lord of the Rings and discovered how lovely this sheer deep blackberry is. I bought it in 2018 after some of you suggested it to me and I recently filmed two big Black Honey videos doing a deep dive into brownie berry lipsticks and balms, testing popular dupes and your suggestions, and swatching some of my favourite formulas in this colour family. Another bright star on TikTok, the delicious Dior Lip Glow Oils. Love these, so I'm a bit stressed about their constantly sold out status now. Sometimes TikTok's power is too strong. This formula, a 2020 favourite, fantastic smooth feel, perfect middle ground texture, so not too thin and slippy like an oil, but not sticky or gloopy like a gloss. Great big cloud couch style doe foot, can't get enough. Very keen to try Mahogany, one of my favourite lip glow balm shades, but the oil isn't out in Australia yet, so I'll be sticking to 012 Rosewood for a flush of sheer colour and a rush of shine. TikTok and Billie Eilish are to thank, apparently, for the rise of Kopari Lip Glossy. Billie was seen swiping this on in an Instagram Live and people raced to buy it. This was one of my 2020 favourites and appeared in my most used lip balm video as well because it's one of my go-to glossy layers to add over a matte lip, particularly a lip liner. I prefer to think of it as more of a really comfy gloss though, not a true hydrating liquid lip balm if my lips are really dry. Slightly runny, thin texture, but it feels feels cushiony and has a nice coconut vanilla flavour. I hope that gives you a bit of a starting point if you're interested in what's trending on TikTok but overwhelmed by the options out there. To make it even easier, I've popped a summary of this list on matildaonvideo.com. I customised my blog from a sleek starting point of one of Squarespace's templates. They have such a great range of really simple, stylish designs, whether you're starting a blog, website or online store, easy to edit, simple social media linking tools and built-in comments if you're blogging. Squarespace offer a free trial, then when you're ready to launch, you can visit squarespace.com slash Matilda to save 10% on your first website or domain name purchase. Are you on TikTok? Are there any massive beauty trends I need to know about over there? Have you tried anything in this top 10? Let me know if you've made any product discoveries on the platform and please share your favourite TikTok beauty creators in the comments so I can have a browse. Thanks for watching. See you next time.